Wow, what a release. I was not expecting this at all. I knew it, this shoe had very high demand, but geez louise, bruh. Holy shit. That is crazy, bro. We're going to talk about the resale of this shoe right here and we're going to look into it what what i'm expecting this shoe to do and also i want to give you guys my thoughts and opinion on these what's going on youtube is your boy tops back at it again with another banger for you guys today man today today was a good day with these uh unc4s i took a l on the ama mayor jordan threes i don't know if i said that name right though but the ama mayor dropped today too as well at 12 eastern time took an l asked me what colors the white house the whole thing you know for like the whole body and all that stuff but this morning man a little recap from this morning this morning i took three w's bro my two nike sneakers account and like the one i have on this phone and on this phone they both hit, my wife's phone hit. So I ended up getting three pairs through Nike sneakers app. And then, of course, last night, shout out to the homies out there and champs, man. Yeah, homie blessed me today with two more pairs. Like I said, man, I'm not, I don't, I don't cook big. I don't cook a lot of pairs. I'm not, I'm not here to brag uh, the amount of shoes I get. Like, I'm happy if I hit one and if it got some resale value, I'm gonna flip it right it's just the mentality i have i love sneakers but shit sneakers are is making me money right now at this point the resale market is tricky to know what's gonna happen what if the shoe's gonna go up the shoe's gonna go down we don't know we don't know it all depends on how comfortable you are to get rid of this shoe but let me go ahead and show you guys what i'm talking about so i ended up buying today i got in hand is a gs size five and a half okay and then i'll show you my personal pair so right here guys we got a size five and a half super good quality on this shoe right here so is the quality on the gs sizes is definitely pretty good all right i haven't seen what the quality control is like but yeah definitely this is the box the gs sizes is coming all right here it is bam and then of course it comes with that million dollar sticker inside this makes the sticker i mean this makes the shoe about another twenty thirty thousand dollars it comes with with the nylon paper in it and then it also comes with the tissue paper in the bottom and the gs sizes all right so here you guys have them bam crazy man super dope shoe in my opinion man i think jordan brand did a really good job with this shoe when I first saw this shoe, shout out to the homie, he got kicks uh, when he came down to Tampa for uh, Sneaker Travelers. He had these, he actually put them on feet the day of the event and shit, he had these shoes like a month and a half early, bro. Crazy. But yeah, definitely a dope shoe, man. And I'm glad to have a nice, decent box for these. But yeah, GS sizes, I'm assuming, okay? I'm not a guru, I don't know that much but the way it feels like oh yeah i see that Ooh, glue stains glue stains right there and you seeing the defects now i know forces pair had a scuff like if it was a scuff mark but it was a glue stain on it. it was somewhere around here if i'm not mistaken but yeah definitely super dope like i'm pretty sure people do not care bro they just want the authentic stuff bro like ain't nothing like having the authentic bro like real talk like if you rock with fakes good for you bro you know you do what you do with your money i'm gonna do what i do with mine gs sizes i see them going for about 300 to 350 at one point no more than that i don't think so but definitely i see them going there now they're about 250 right now and they're doing pretty good in the market so i want to see what they're what they're what they're hitting for right now so i like to go around goat right now uh the i want to see the gs sizes okay gs sizes and i'm gonna go over to like the five and a half and the five and a half actually went up 14 dollars right this afternoon it was 260 uh 250 now they're at 264 okay the gs sizes so i feel like the gs sizes is gonna go up in price i say no more than 350 depending on the size you have you know if you're copying gs sizes i recommend you to cop gs sizes on this shoe 
Even if you're paying 260 right now, 250, I will pay that right now because I know this shoe is gonna go up in height. A lot of people are taking L's. There's a lot of cities that ain't get these like that. I know our city, very limited. I just got blessed by the homie over there because of networking, you know what I'm saying? If you guys don't follow me on my IG, link will be in the description below. Also, I will be posting shoes that I put up for raffle or for sale on that page as well, which is Tops World Kicks. Make sure you guys check that out in the description below as well. Both my IG pages are on there. Make sure you guys follow the boy. I don't follow people back on the Tops World Kicks, but on the top store YT, hell yeah, I'll shout you a follow. You know what I'm saying? That's the page that I'm at the most. I just do a lot of sneaker deals on that page right there. So, bam, here is a size 13, man. Size 13. I like the shape. I love the shape of the shoe. I really, I am really digging it. Really good job, uh, Jordan Brand, in my opinion. Really good pair from what it seems like. I was looking through it, at least on the left foot. It seems to be pretty good. I'll show you guys the right foot now. But basically, everything is it seems to be i'm happy with it i'm definitely happy with it so sometimes when it comes to shoes like this you got to be careful because there could be some defects on it and nike and jordan brand don't care they will ship them out people will buy them up they don't care they're just willing to make their money so man like i don't know if you guys know man but this shoe right here is still at the 400 price range this shoe right here this size right now of the day of release is at $405 on go and they're selling bro there are they are selling so you know what I'm saying they're selling they're selling at that price if they were to dip they'll probably dip down to 340 350 the max and then it will go right back up to the 400 shit you probably got sizes probably hitting $500 I would I would I will see that shoe at this part now do i know that's gonna happen no i'm just saying like i feel this is the way i feel i feel like the gs sizes are gonna be up in the 350 shit don't be surprised if they do peak up to that four but these right here definitely the men's sizes are definitely gonna do numbers um even with the amount of pairs that are out there they're still gonna do numbers a lot of people are doubling up on these because it's gonna be a shoe that they're gonna be wearing a lot because UNC vibes, bro. You can't go wrong with it, man. And shout out to Cuzzo Clothing, man. He gave me a, he gave me a hoodie that I'm definitely gonna be rocking these when it comes to the winter times out here in Florida for the two or three cold days that we get. Hell yeah, I'm gonna be rocking that Cuzzo Clothing hoodie, man. You know what I'm saying? So super dope. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section down below. Let me go ahead and show you my box. So this is my box right here. Basically, the lighting is super bright in here, so check it out there you go so super dope man you got that unc jordan jump man flight right here you got your cement print box and here is my tag okay here's my tag super fire man i am super stoked that i got these i haven't technically and on a shoe like this bro i've been hyped for these bro i was even willing to pay but these things were at a thousand dollars my size were at a thousand dollars man so as you guys can see right here, man, here's the right shoe. Super fire, man, super dope. I am happy that I got these things in my possession. I ain't gotta worry about it, but I do got three more pairs coming in tomorrow. I did the next day shipping on Nike sneakers. But I'm gonna go ahead and see what, how is the, co the quality control of these things right here, man. So we're gonna go ahead and check it out and check out my, my reaction. Yeesh. Mm, mm. Wow. Yeah. Damn. That's going to be tricky. Dope air unit. All right, man. In some places, the glue stains, they there. The glue stains are here on these puppies, man. But, man, check out that bottom, though, man. Ooh. Jeez Louise. Yes, sir. Bro, I'm happy I got these things in the collection. You already know how your boy tops get down. I had to throw on the fire reds. I think this was what gave me luck today. You know, everybody talked down on these things, but you know, I, I don't, man. I like them. I like the fact that the way they look when the, as, as soon as you rock them things. But I don't know if I'm going to give you guys an on foot in this video or not, but check it out, man. We got the UNC4s, bro. Tell me what you think. Speaking about it, I gotta ship these shoes out from the raffle. So I'll see you guys on the next bank. Peace.